I just stumbled upon this project called as IMS Toucan. Seems quite interesting. The bit which really surprised me that with the help of this toolkit, you can generate speech to text in more than 7000 languages. How good is that? And the way they have done is, is quite interesting in my opinion. So all in all, this is just an MIT licensed text to speech model in 7000 languages. And if your language is not present in that 7000 languages, then you can even fine tune it very easily. Plus, uh, I'm very curious if your language is not included in the 7000 languages. So please do uh, comment it in the comment section that which language you speak, which is not even in that 7000 set. So the way they created it uh, was they built a text front end that can turn text in any language from ISO 639-3 list into language agnostic articulate trained features and then they pre-trained a speech synthesis to convert these features into speech for 462 languages. Finally, they applied meta learning to fill in the remaining languages for which they had no data. To top it off, they also open sourced their data set too. Now, not only that, but as I said, this IMS Toucan is a toolkit for teaching, training and using state of the art speech synthesis models developed at the Institute for Natural Language Processing or IMS, University of Stuttgart, Germany. Everything is pure Python and PyTorch based to keep it as simple and beginner friendly yet powerful as possible. I don't agree with the beginner friendly bit. It's not easy to install and run and there are a lot of bugs so you would have to fight a lot. Sorry, I'm being very frank here. I have tried it out. It started working but takes a lot of effort and time so that is why I'm not bothering with doing the installation here. Instead, I'm just going to show you their hosted demo which is on the hugging face here. So um, I would highly, I would suggest that at this point in time, even the project is a bit old, it's not stable. In my opinion, there are a lot of bugs, lot of issues with it. So if you're looking to try it out, go to this uh, from their repo. There are a few demos. So for example, this is a controllable text to speech for over 7,000 languages. Just give your text here, select your languages from here, and then give the seed and all that stuff and use from there. So these are all the languages and there are heaps of them heaps so which is a good part so this is a bit of a uh, shame that it's a bit hard to run anyway and now as it is running the t4 so sometime you will get some of the timeouts but uh, let's run it and see how it works so meanwhile it happens let me also show you the installation steps if you are keen on the surface installation steps are easy so all you need to do is to just create a python environment once the environment is done, just uh, install all the requirements. Also, if you're on the Linux, uh, which is the preferred one in my opinion, make sure that you have this eSpeak ng installed. This is just a speech synthesizer and ng for next generation. Once you have it installed, then all you need to do is for inference, you need to run this to download. Uh, so you just load the trained model by running this. Now, Another thing you need to do is that after that you need to run this I run model downloader.py. This is a bit which doesn't work at all for me at least uh, despite of fixing trying to juggle with all the Python ones. So instead of wasting time, I think I spent like two hours on it, but doesn't work. A lot of dependency issues even when you install the requirements. And I have checked at their issues the github repo lot of issues are there so anyway if you get it working let me know how on ubuntu i'll be keen to try it out again anyway so once you have get it out of the way somehow then you all you need to do is to run this or i think the better way would be that instead of running this one if you sorry i'm just scrolling very rapidly up run this run gui demo.py and it is going to open hopefully a GUI like this. So this is the installation one. Anyway, so while we were talking, it has generated it. So let me play it out. The woods are lovely, dark and deep, but I have promises to keep and miles to go before I sleep. Mm, that is good, right? And I really like the way they have done the visualization too. So it's a shame that, you know, installation instructions are not really good enough. And there are a few bugs, but I'm sure 
as the project is evolving and you know they're also responding on the issues so it should be uh, stable soon hopefully i think because if it does become a stable project i think this will be one of the top ones uh, in my opinion and i have done a lot of videos on tts tool as you can check on the channel so hopefully uh, fingers crossed it is be it is going to be stable soon let me know what do you think if you have used it please share your experience and if you were managed to get it installed on ubuntu or even windows please share your experience too because we are all learning together here thanks for watching if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel thanks